welcome back to another preview of the Lorg chart. I wanted to make a quick update on how work is progressing and also show you my recent changes to the Lorg chart. I've been primarily working on changing the basic structure of the races. So here on the left hand side you can see the old structure for Cabal. It's structured but not uh, entirely structured, if you know what I mean. If you look at a, a different race, let's go down to Fallen, it's a different kind of structure. So I've been moving stuff around. This is sort of inspired by talks with the Guest in the Ghost Stories podcast and the Focus Fire Team podcast. So thank you a lot for that inspiration. Let me just give some stuff to my one and a half year old. There you go. So this is the new kind of layout I've been working on. It's more structured. And as you can see here, I've done Vex and Cabal. I've done uh, the Fallen too. It follows the basic kind of structure down. So if you have the Cabal node on the top, you follow it down, you have information on the left hand side, units going down. You can see the, uh, the Cabal command structure. And going on the right side, you can follow sort of the different regiments within. So down here we have Sand Eaters, where they can be found, the descriptive um, Grimoire, if I found any uh, banners possible leaders and their descriptions following going out. So uh, let's look at another example, the Vex over here, information on the left hand side and on the right hand side sort of a structural representation of how I interpret the uh, Vex to work, the different subsystems and their respective information and also different nodes for each type of race the Volta class has its own node. Yeah, and I'll be trying to to work in as much information as I can, but it's going it's going slow. Uh, one example here, the progeny trying to get a picture of them. Isn't it easy as you can think? There goes another toy from my one year old. Let's see. There you go. I have to cut this short soon. And over here we have the Elixni, same basic structure so you can, you know from different races what you're looking at. We have the units over here going down with the ethyl flow. Up here we have the catch and the different vehicles. The Elder Cipher over here. And going out here we have the Fallen Houses. Now this, as you can see, Fallen takes up a lot more space than the Vex do, but this is also incorporating the future, the future will probably bring more, bring more information about different kinds of races. So I want these layouts to be more structured and more, they should be able to grow in a different way. So that's basically it. I'm going to work on, I haven't gotten to Hive yet, that's my next part, so that's going to take a while. So that's what I'm uh, doing right now. And I also have reported the bug, the, the, the problem with the memory issues for the shot reader to IBM and they are going to address it next uh, iteration as far as I know. So that's it. Thank you for watching. See you.